The ending of a video game should be the pinnacle of your experience. The good guy saves the day, and usually the bad guy meets their demise. Over the past 15 years, games have regularly offered an alternate ending, giving the gamer a slightly more fitting final scene which matches their playstyle or chosen character. Today, we run down 5 great alternate video game endings. As always, watch out for spoilers for the following. Mortal Kombat has had hundreds of different endings over the years due to each character having their own little subplot. When Mortal Kombat 4 came around, Jax and Sonya were tracking down a chap named Jerick. If you complete the tournament Fatality. and win with Sonya, you receive this acting masterclass. It's over, Jerick. Shinnok is dead. The good guys won. You're coming back with me. Never, Sonya. I agreed to help defeat Shinnok, not turn myself into the special forces. The Black Dragon, live on! The Black Dragon died with Kano. You're the last one, Jerick. Never! Where was the Pause that, because if you complete the game as Jerick, the end scene continues. Come in, Major Briggs. This is Lieutenant Sonya Blade. Whoa! Ah! Sonya, this is Major Briggs. Come in. Sonya, this is Jax. Are you there? <laughs> and guess what? If you complete the game as Jax, the ending continues again. <laughs> going somewhere, Jerick? Jax! I thought you were going to. Thought I was what? Dead, like my heart being just tossed off the cliff. I'm, I'm sorry, Jax. Please, don't drop me. Wait, I, I promise. Too late, Jarek. You can't drop me. You have to uphold the law. You have to arrest me. Wait, wait. This is brutality. You can't do it. Wrong, Jarek. This is not a brutality. This is a fatality. I think these three went to John Claude Van Damme's acting school. And don't worry about Sonya, she returned in the very next game, and she's still here today. Well, not this. We have a party waiting for you. Far Cry 4's evil dictator, Pagin Min, may look like a dancer from Gangnam style, but he is in fact a great antagonist. Fighting your way through thousands of enemies for the chance to meet him again was thrilling, and the sandbox we are given is testament to open world gaming. I personally spent 30 hours in Nirat before I saw the end credits roll. But what if I told you the game could be finished in 13 minutes? Yes, 13 minutes. During the opening stages of the game, our hero meets with Min to ask if he can place his mother's ashes alongside her daughter. Pagan suddenly begins to torture and presumably kill a guest at his table, so the player's gut instinct is to get out as soon as possible. Those fucking terrorists, they ruin everything. Like dinner! Did no one ever teach you but if you are patient, if you sit still, if you stay, you are taken to the end of the game without shooting a single weapon. Maybe dictators have a bad name. Thank you, Kamran. You want me to follow? Jesus Christ. Yes, boy, the ashes aren't going to scatter themselves. Oh, good. You feel better now? Get it out of your system? Good. Maybe now we can finally shoot some goddamn guns. You cannot have an alternate ending countdown without GTA 5. After spending time with Michael, Trevor and Franklin, it's easy to see them as a dysfunctional family, kind of like my own. But by the time the final mission comes around, you are given three choices. Hey, a. Kill team. Michael. B. Kill Trevor. Know. Or risk everything and pick right. C. Hey, Death hey, Wish. Hey, my bad, homie. I pick C. Ain't that a bitch. Studies show that about 80% of people pick C, which means millions of people have not played through the other permutations. Killing Michael is quite depressing and doesn't serve the storyline in the slightest, but killing Trevor actually makes sense. 
He's an insane murderer who will probably kill you at some point. So by choosing this option, you take part in a car chase before Trevor hits a gasoline truck or petrol tanker or whatever it's called in your country. I know it's hard to pull the trigger now, so don't worry, Michael will do it for you. Now sit back and enjoy your friend burning to death. Silent Hill 2 was freaking scary. Constant fog, terrible dialogue, and terrifying enemies. It was a masterpiece. There are in fact six endings which arguably suit the storyline, but one stands out above the rest. If your hero chooses a specific room to enter at a certain point in the game, he can meet the villain of the piece. The real villain. And it's a dog. Seriously, a dog using a computer with a headset on. From being one of the most frightening games of its time to being one of the most ridiculous in seconds. It only gets worse when the end credits roll and instead of an eerie track, you are rewarded with a dog barking sound. Let's pretend this never happened. to the Far Cry series for our final entry, Far Cry 3 to be more specific. This game will be forever immortalised for Vaz, but I'll leave talking about him for another video. It's really his sister that plays an important part in this one. In the last few seconds of the game, you are given a choice to rescue your friends, which as you'd expect is the right thing to do, or you can kill your friends. Yep, that's seriously an option. Things get a little more twisted when you are treated to this sex scene moments after murdering your own friends. but. That's not the worst part. Hold me. You are perfection. The ultimate. Moral of the story don't trust a naked chick with a knife. Well, that's what my dad always told me anyway. So that's it, five of the greatest alternative endings in video games. I know there are many, many, many more, so please let us know your favourites in the comments below. If you've enjoyed wasting time with us, please give us a like and consider subscribing. I'll see you again next time.